Do you need a pair of high heel boots for your next cosplay? Want it to be super simple and won't break the bank? Then I've got you covered. What you'll need, a pair of shoes, a four way stretch fabric like Lycra, matching thread, pins, fabric scissors and a sewing machine. And to draft your own pattern you will need a large sheet of paper like butcher's paper, a marker and some paper scissors. If you don't feel comfortable drafting your own pattern, I can recommend instead that you can use Yaya Hun's McCall pattern M7397. There are a few variations in there for boot covers and it's easy to use. Let's begin. Lay the sheet of paper on a flat surface. Next, put on one of your shoes and with your marker, draw around your leg and the shoe. It's a little awkward to show me getting on a table here, so let's just use some magic. You'll see I've left the heel of the shoe open. That's because I want the heel to be exposed. If you also want to cover the heel, sure, draw around that too. But hey, we're not done here yet. Next, smooth out your lines a bit and mark roughly where you want the boot to end. I've made a special zigzag to mark the placement of the heel. Then, add seam allowance. For around the sides and underneath the shoe, I added an extra 2.5cm. On the heel, I did an additional 1.5cm on top of the 2.5cm, so 4cm. And then, cut it out using your paper scissors, not fabric scissors because that, my friends, is a sewing sin. Pin the pattern onto a folded piece of the fabric and cut it out using fabric scissors. Then repin just the two layers together. Do not cut out the second boot cover just yet. On your sewing machine, change over to a zigzag stitch. Then sew around the sides and the bottoms, keeping the heel and the top open. Use a one and a half centimeter seam allowance. With the boot cover wrong side out, slip your shoe into the cover. Now try it on to see how it fits. It should be firm and tight, just not cutting off circulation. This isn't looking too bad. However, it needs a few adjustments. Firstly, I need to shorten the boot. I also need to take in the cover at the toe. Also, some around the ankle. So I take some in from the front and the back. It helps to mark with pins to the seams so you know where the changes start and end. Once it's all pinned, carefully take it off. Let's do this. Next, let's make the changes. Firstly, cut off any extra length. Then lock in the stitches that you have just cut off by going over them with the machine. Then go around and sew where the pins are. On the fresh seams, mark out 1.5cm seam allowance and cut off the excess fabric. Now you have the perfect pattern. Lay your completed boot cover over a folded piece of fabric. Pin it, cut it out, repin the two freshly cut layers together and sew. Now that you have two boot covers, cut away any excess fabric from the seams. Next up, fold in the top of the boot cover and sew it with a zigzag stitch. I'm doing it here by eye and it's about a one centimeter fold. If you're worried about the top of the boot rolling or moving down whilst being worn, you can also add some elastic here. If you're really worried, you can look at sewing or pinning the boot to the layer underneath the boot, such as pants or tights. Next. Let's talk about the heel. You may want to cover it right down to the grip. If you do this, make sure you allow for this in the pattern drafting stage. Also, you may want to consider gluing down the fabric to the shoe, but this means that that shoe is forever that boot. The second option is to hem it. This allows for the shoe to be removed and used for other projects. I did my hems by folding the fabric over whilst it was inside out and sewing it down with a zigzag stitch. Oh, and one last thing, let's talk about safety. Grip is important. Make sure that you keep the heel grip free and consider adding an anti-slip shoe grip or some other type of sole to the ball of the foot. You can get them cheaply off places like eBay. And then you're done. Whether you're cosplaying a superhero or an anime character or something else, May these boots help you walk in those character shoes. I hope you found this helpful, and if you have any questions, feel free to fire them my way. 
If you've enjoyed this, please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel and liking my Facebook page.